Well, hasn't the next gen Ranger become an absolute hot favourite of us out here four wheel driving? Today, I want to talk you through this setup because what a sleek looking car it is. And the new Raid Bar has absolutely got the market's attention. We've got customers that are absolutely raving about this new bar. And it is just a beautiful package. We've got it in front of us here today. So I just wanted to quickly walk you through it. Of course, our Raid Bar is a full bumper replacement bar. It's got all the structural integrity that you would come to expect from an Ironman Deluxe Bar, but it's just a stripped back version. It looks fantastic, really just sets off the whole look of the vehicle, but still has all the functionality that you'd expect from a bull bar in that it is capable of maintaining your 12,000 pound winch. We've got integrated lights options here, including the light bar, fog lights, cube lights in the side here. We've got integrated recovery points that come included with the Raid Bar. So we've got two five ton recovery points there for a maximum of 10 ton combined. Another really nice feature of these is the skid plate. That skid plate at the front is no longer just a wind deflector or a stone deflector. This is a proper four mil steel skid plate that's actually included in the front of the bar. So we've just got a fantastic off-road bull bar here that is sleek, it's functional, it's structural, and it's gonna absolutely set off the look of your Ranger. Of course, as we come down the side of the vehicle here, we've got our new Ironman 4x4 fender flares. The fender flares, of course, are increasing the width of the fenders on your vehicle, uh, giving you that little bit extra width, allowing you to have more options when it comes to choosing your rim offsets, tires, and getting that package right. Of course, having a wider track also increases your off-road stability. As we come down the side of the car here, we've also got our Ironman side steps, a steel construction side step with a new dimple plate with a textured finish. But even though it's a textured finish, it's really easy to clean, really easy to keep looking smart and, uh, and really grippy for when you're getting in and out of the car. Up the top, we've got our Atlas platform roof rack. Uh, great to have platform racks, it just means you can store things on there so much easier rather than maybe just crossbars. Though crossbars can be really functional in, in some cases, this is the one we've chosen for this vehicle. We've of course got our treads up there and, and a shovel, we've got some other bits and pieces. Having the light up here on the front is actually not just a, a fantastic functional thing for obviously having more light out the front of your vehicle. It's also fantastic for reducing the wind noise even further. So super quiet inside the cabin of this Ranger, thanks to having that light bar just sitting nicely underneath the roof rack. And I think personally just really setting off the whole look of the front of this vehicle. And of course, it's essential to get your suspension set up. So this Ford Ranger is running on our Foam Cell Pro technology. Uh, Foam Cell Pro is a fantastic setup. They're a bigger shock absorber, great heat dispensation. So they're gonna be able to take anything that you have to throw at them. Really good ride and valving control. So a great option if you're looking for a two inch lift for your Ford Ranger. That's about the front of it, but we'll quickly spin this car around and show you a little bit about what we've done out the back. When it comes to the back of the car, we're talking practicality, but we're also trying to keep it absolutely slick and we're loving the look of what we've got going on the back of this next gen. So what we've done is we've put on our electric tonneau, the slide away, which is fantastic for waterproofing the back of the car, but being able to have great access at the click of a button. On the top of it, we're running again, one of our Atlas platform racks. The platform racks just give you the ultimate in versatility. You've just got a, a really good platform there, naturally, to be able to put all these bits and pieces on, of course. We've put our swag up there, but there's an endless amount of accessories. We could have gas bottle holders and jerry can holders, and we could have put our shovel down there. There's really no end to how you could set this particular setup. We've even, to this point, gone out of our way to get our UHF mounted perfectly on the back there, keeping the front of the car nice and clean, but making sure that we don't in any way compromise on having our radio communication. Of course, at the back here, we've also got the Iron Man rear bar. And as we open up the rear tailgate, we've got tucked away in here, our 65 litre dual zone fridge, the M series, ice cube fridge by Iron Man. We've got that sitting on one of our slides, so we can slide that straight out. We've got one of our cases here, the maxi cases to be able to just store all of our classic camping essentials are in there. We've got all of our chairs and tables are wrapped up nice and small. They sit in there as well as our cooking gear and, and other bits and pieces. So there it is, a fantastic setup for just getting you out on the tracks, keeping it simple, but absolutely giving you a stunner looking next gen Ford Ranger. So if you're interested in learning anything more about the full range of Ironman 4x4 accessories for the next gen Ford Ranger, or maybe you'd like to learn a little bit more about the new Raid Bars that are coming out thick and fast for all popular models of four-wheel drive, by all means, get in contact with your local Ironman 4x4 store, learn a little bit more about what we've got to offer, and hope to see you out here on the track soon.